Here I have a pleasure of introducing and uh, sharing with you the case of a patient with a stage 4 pancreatic cancer that I treated recently. Uh, this man, Asian man, was uh, diagnosed with uh, very advanced uh, pancreatic adenocarcinoma in March of this year, 2017. He was seen at City of Hope and uh, his oncologist, upon diagnosis, had claimed that uh, he would not have a lot to live because of the advancement of his disease into his liver. He was totally jaundiced had malignant ascites, was not able to walk, and he was in extreme pain to the point that they had started him on morphine drip and referred him to hospice because he could not tolerate any chemotherapy. When he came to see me in uh, late June, he um, was not able to uh, walk or even be able to tolerate any food. He was constantly vomiting. And uh, even with very high doses of morphine intravenously, he was still in pain. Uh, I had a very detailed conversation with his family and, ex and explained to them that, generally speaking, patients with this uh, degree of disease in their liver would not be able to tolerate any conventional treatments as his bilirubin was 8.1 and he was totally jaundiced. And the family were from beginning not in favor of uh, standard treatments and they were seeking out to see if any other potential treatments could be available for him to at least improve his quality of life. There was no intention to improve his survival at least by the family and I was myself puzzled if the treatments that I can offer him could potentially result in improved survival considering his advanced disease. We started him on the treatment uh, July 1st of 2017 and the first few weeks of treatment resulted in decreased tumor markers uh, just after 10 treatments. His quality of life had improved slightly in the first two weeks. Then he had an infection and he went to the hospital to be treated for C. diff. And he came back and restarted the treatment after two weeks of delay. We were able to accomplish a significant and drastic response upon his return just in a matter of four weeks. In the month of August, his labs, as he was getting treatments here, dropped significantly. His jaundice completely resolved. His bilirubin dropped from 8.1 to 0 0.8. His tumor marker, CEA, dropped from 3,408 to 305. His quality of life improved as such that the hospice care was stopped. The scan confirmed shrinkage of total mass both in pancreas as well as all liver lesions. He was able to gain energy and stamina back enough to be able to function and perform daily activities on his own. As we speak, in September of 2017, he does not require any dependence on his mobility. He does not require any pain medication. And his jaundice is completely resolved. He has come back to a normal person. And his labs also have confirmed that his liquid biopsy with circulatory DNA of positive KRAS, which is the most aggressive type, of GI malignancies has dropped from 35% initially when I saw him to only 2%, normal being less than 0 0.2. We are looking forward to continue his care in the next few months, but it appears to me that he has far exceeded his expected results and survival from what 
extend our treatment can offer him. He will share his experience with you shortly. Thank you. Hi, my name is Oscar and my wife is Lita. On April 24, 2017, I was diagnosed with the stage 4 pancreatic cancer and meds to the liver. And my doctor told us that I had to leave six months to leave. So my boys, Dean and Jay, and with my wife, decided to do something and found Dr. Nasami. And we first contacted Dr. Nasami. I was so down, felt so weak, and I've been ready to give up my life. But now, after receiving five weeks treatment with Dr. Nasami, I've grown stronger and ready to face whatever is necessary to be with my family, my grandkids, and hopefully this can improve with Dr. Nasami. Hi, my name is Oscar and I'm now on my fifth month with Dr. Nasami. The first time I seen him, I could not even eat, I could not even smell any food. I was always nauseated, uh, I was in pain all the time, I had morphine on the go. But now on my fifth month, I don't, have, I don't need any more pain, medicine. I can almost do everything I want by myself now. I can walk, I can go to the store. I do everything that I need to do by myself now. I, I wish I could recommend this to everybody to come and see Dr. Nasani, just like me. You can get stronger, you can get your pain out, good no more vomiting. Quality of life. And a better quality of life now. Thank you.